Hey there, welcome back to Wonderbine. I'm Suffer with Let's Suffer Together, back with the full release version of the game 1.0 and Grove Tan. I'm not sure we'll stick with him. I think he ran yesterday on stream. Oh. Kurtz, how you doing? Like, you pat the dogs? I think Kurtz needs to be patable, you know? You know, there's that Twitter account, Can You Pat the Dog? I think there needs to be a Can You Pat the Kurtz, you know? Because Kurtz, he's been, he's seen some shit, no wonder he's smoking that pipe. You know, he never puts it down. That's kind of addictive behavior. I can one, relate to, and two. Just, you know, he needs some hobbies. He needs to be able to do something outside of just... Well, he's got this lady, or whoever, or whatever, I don't even know. I mean, I'm taking a close look. Can't tell, doesn't matter. Irrelevant. Anyway. Grove time. Yeah, gone. We've got a car. And Karukia. Oh, I can't even pronounce that name. Can't pronounce it, so you're gone. I've done the... Jefta. He's got an X in his name. He's extreme. Zalta. What a dude. Red dude, passionate dude, you know? We're gonna talk, we're gonna go near the mine. We need to keep on that streak, have a nice casual run. Nice casual run, because we're streaming quite a bit recently, obviously, with the mine 1.0, and hey. No, we need to jump, jump. Oh no, I missed, I, I kinda, oh. You know what happened, you saw it, you're not blind. Anyway, <laughs> let's get in there. The other mine is a great way for demonstrating. New things as well sometimes. Interesting, we get HP, we get two potion slots. Swing damage, throw damage, no throw distance. Yeah, we go with money, we definitely go with money. The cost of penance has doubled. Yeah, lanterns being fired at me is horrible. We'll go with that. I could have my HP taken away for two armor. Oh, item duplication or HP swing damage and attack speed. Item doubling. <laughs> oh, that's a difficult one. I think we go with armor, buddy, though. And thus we take the HP back. Get two armor. We are ready. We're ready to go. Hmm. All items are hidden. No. Can't heal. No. <laughs> Take damage when picking up gold. No. I need. I mean, I need gold. Uh, I don't know if you know that. We're definitely going to start introducing these at some point. I just need to be damn sure I'm comfy with everything before I put my streak on the line. Maybe use my clone save file to have a practice or two. Um, floors no longer have relic rooms. Adds an indestructible curse on every floor. Yeah, I run away. Either way. While I'm still streaming heavily and going over my allotted amount of hours I normally prescribe for myself. Again. Doing nice, chill, noiter, or undermine runs are on the cards. We're doing high summoning stone runs on stream. And uh, it's been a blast, you know? Been an absolute blast. Thank you everybody who supported those runs on stream. We're up to 170, you saw it when we started the run on save file, 171 I think, something like that. Ooh, dear me, <laughs> 171, it's crazy, it's absolutely ridiculous. However, some of the runs we've been able to, you know, pull out of the bag, have been crazy. Whoop, but, Zalta here today, ooh, fire, oh, run away. Zalta is the man, we technically never need to remove this curse, as long as we don't take major curse. The problem comes when we get other arch chambers and start getting other major curse. That'd be a problem. All right, dudes. He's gone for it. Oh, spike him. <laughs> Use the enemies to kill the other enemies. You know, that's peak performance, that. Oh, thank you. <laughs> that helps me out immensely. Oh, Paladin Shield. Increase stats, HP. Does it, this, this, this is meant to increase stats, you know. It doesn't increase HP. <laughs> doesn't do it for me. However, we've got more money. We can get more money. Curse removal. Cheap curse removal for me. However, we can get throw damage or throw distance. We probably go throw distance. You know, because that is pathetic. My dude, you're meant to be extreme, my friend. You're meant to be extreme. He's not doing it for us. We got cleave, however. And some extra damage. I mean, 28. Paladin shield. Must increase your base damage by a certain amount. It's the only way I can see it working. With what I've seen in regular Undermine. But we're going to have a good day today. It's going to be, you know, 
Extreme. Zalta. And it should be spelt with a Z, but you put an X instead on the application form. Hey, good times, you know? I respect it. When you wear a crown like this, when you've got a sentry buddy who... You know, an armored buddy who protects you every move. Yeah, throw damage, throw distance. We're racking up some pain and suffering, innit? For the enemy? Oh, we get the bomb. We... We open that chest. We possibly... We've got two armor, so we're removing the curse right now. We don't need the money. You know, there's a secret room, though. I guarantee you. But we're not going to do it, because this is guaranteed money and something else. If it's food as well. Oh, we get a miniature chest. Oi! Oi, you pilfer bastards. You see, it don't need to hit them. Just scare them away. Even more money and food. So we'll remove the curse, because money at the moment, we've got extra money. Yeah, 100 HP to remove a curse because of the penance curse we have. It would be 50, but it's 100. Luckily, that never goes up, like in regular Undermine. Well, in, unlike in regular Undermine. That never moves upwards. The more you curse, remove. However, in other mine, it stays static, which is very nice. And we're very nice at the moment. Nearly 300 money is a little bit of, you know, extra damage on both of them. Relics at the start, extra money. This is one extreme peasant. Wait for it. Make you move. <laughs> Make you move when you've already been fired at, and that projectile is already on its trajectory. However, at the mine, one down. That was a success. It was good times. Let's move. We've got armor. He's my armor buddy. I might buy armor. Even if I don't need it. Because it levels up my dude. And he, this guy can level up quite late, because obviously, if you're alright at the game like myself, you know, you're not so bad. You might actually not be picking up much armor. Even if you, you know, could technically pick it up. <laughs> oh, more, right, if you've got Eliodon, um, well, however you pronounce it, you always seem to find more armor stuff. I mean, three armor, that almost covers me for being on fire or poison, you know what I mean? It's... We can charge at the enemy. Riddle it. We'll see. Hopefully we'll get curse removal in the shop. That would be a good thing. Hello. Obviously my swing throw technology. We are now Thor himself. With an electric attack. Oh, he's trying to melee me. Oh, there's an interesting thing with the skellies. If you stand a certain distance away, they don't, they don't attack you. They literally just, you know, chill. They don't know what to do. Whether to attack you or... Well, whether to melee or throw you. You want 400, don't you? Milady. And we'll try and procure that for you, depending on what's in the shop. Again, with the extra money we've got, maybe we make it. We should do. We definitely should do. Ah, good times. Sorry, Pilfer. It's not your lucky day. There, yeah, keys though, keeping me in good resources. I don't want the game to make me regret missing the popcorn, so we need keys, we need bombs. If I get Keyblade, it was the good strat. Interesting, we get another bomb then. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, I just realized. Crazy eyes. Curse. Didn't give me money as well. Hold on, hold on, I've got an idea. Yep, told you. <laughs> Oh, bomb, bomb size? We're, we're hopefully going to get gold bombs. No money, though. Is there any money anywhere? You do want 400, don't you? Because you normally want 400, my lady. Oh, my boy, moustache in the house. Black rubbish test game house. What do you say? Pay me 400. Blah, blah. Are you sure? It's a pretty cool game. Well, we probably just don't lose, you know, 300. I'll probably get 100 back, definitely. Um, Right, because I've just got that blessing, and there's a blessing downstairs. What I could do, I could take this in anticipation that we've already got our two blessings for the three floors. And there's two shrines, so it equals out. If I take this, remove the curse afterwards. We get a HP potion. Chests are trapped more often, so I don't open this potion until we get rid of chests are trapped more often. Because, uh, give me some bombs. That's not a bad curse at all. We lose a bit of money. We lose some resources. We make a move, we go away in. Hold on, there's a bush there. Always be destroying bushes. No money, but hey ho. Have we got anything we need to buy? HP. We actually go get the uh, 
increase blessing options. I could take this, but I want to save some money, you know? Extreme Zalta is, uh, you know, on a mission. And that mission requires money, financial support. No one will back him but himself. You know, he came down trying to get sponsorship for his other mine run in Peasant Village. No one's got any money, though. That's why the peasants, you know, tried to go to Middle Class Village. And they all laughed at him, said it can't be done. <laughs> and, uh, you know, he's here to make good on his investment. To try and win that all expenses paid holiday to anywhere in the world, depending how much money he makes. Throw damage. You see, this is why we save money. Yeah. Are we... I never really like to spend 150 to change all these, because they could change into the exact same thing. We could potion... Right, empty bottles are now awesome. Um, two, it's always 200 to buy more, so we buy the throw damage, we buy the empty bottle slot. So I can start stacking. Should have checked the other shop, but we'll get money. We earn some good money. Throw swing, throw. My swing throw technology knows no bounds. Hold on. Get him! Get it! Oh, beautiful. You know, you've got to play baseball, and that is some chunky money. I really, really enjoy this run. And it's got some pace to it. It's got some energy, you know? Yeah, we definitely use a key on that. Oh, it might be... Oh, no, these can't be trapped. Yeah. And now we've got another shot. Pilfer, you do not take the big chunks. I don't mind you taking a five chunk. I mean, that is your right as a pilfer. But the big chunks? No, 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 sir. No, no, no. HP. Yep, HP and the old key. And I think we're done. We've got no money. However, we've got three armor. So I don't mind just removing this curse and being 100 HP down, you know? Yeah, those vile pot attacks now are more vicious. Watch out for them. They will dominate you. Can we get another amazing relic? Throw damage at high health? I mean, we don't have bad throw damage. It could be improved. We'll probably get like three or four damage. I'm not... I've got no money. Take it. Four damage. I mean, that is essentially a blessing and a half. Like a throw damage blessing and a half. You know what I mean? That's a secret. I call it here right now. Can we get some food out of it? Ooh. Now, what I do, I do for you. <laughs> anyway, that wasn't what I meant to say. Um, there's money in the wall. What I do is, I remove the curse. I don't take that curse chest. Despite the fact I could get a Shogul if I keep on taking Major Curse. Ah, oh, Cleave. I don't need Cleave. we got Paladin Shield. And I don't want to start stacking Major Curse. Yeah, it's only 50 HP now. I don't mind leaving without full HP. But we can use this now for more money. It's a locked chest, but we open it because I'll get resources back. Not enough money to buy a key, unfortunately, but... Hey, we've still got one key, and that's all we need. Hopefully a lot of the shops I'll be able to bomb open, and we'll have a good time. Hello, nori old friend, old pal, old buddy, old chum. We've got many an armor. This guy's got nothing. We've got our swing throw technology. What has he got? Just a grinny... Toothless. Well, he's got tooth. You know, crooked teeth. Is, is he British? <laughs> the old. Oh, can you do it? Oh, he can. That good throw. And the good swing throw tech. How much extra. Sorry, how much extra crit do I have? Right, Paladin Shield gave me 5% extra crit chance, and it gave me 5% extra crit multiplier. Not that much at all. But it's something. It seems to just give you primarily good swing damage. Got it. We got at least one. Got two. We can use these balls. Got it. And loop it round quickly. Jump. Jump and a jump. What is this? Triple jump, you know? Get him. Get aggressive. This is extreme. Haven't even been tapped yet. Not once. <laughs> Have I been hit this run? Apart from me actually penancing myself. Right, I want to take this. So what I do, I go in the controls. And since I don't want to set myself on fire or use a bomb. Food consumed at full health, 10 on. I should gain experience with this. I'm not sure if I do, actually. Because I might need to have this armor slot. It's good science, though, because I've never done that before. 
not by accident. Well, not on purpose, sorry, and check him. One minute boss fight. And I do love these arch chambers. Anti-chambers, sorry. Ooh. 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 Receive more damage? I'll take that, because I don't want to lose keys. More bomb size? Interesting, because if I get a glaze, crit damage doesn't really mean much, but resources for the bomb size and destruction. And if we get a glaze, we can get one more money, one more HP. Uh, 20% extra damage when I throw at the enemy once for about 20 seconds. Or throw damage, swing size and swing speed. I'm gonna wear a crown. Zalta needs to find his queen. His queen peasant, my lady. And we take receive more damage, because it's not going to matter in the long run. Three armor, and there's more about. More armor to be found. More foes to be slain. It's going to be a good time. And money. We actually possibly leave the money on the floor. Hello. If I have spare money, I might be able to get good resources for cheap. So we'll... Before we make decisions, and it's what I like to do mostly in roguelike games. Get all the information possible. You know, all the information on the floor possible and then make decisions if it can be done. If I'm not in trouble, if I can wait, get in the hole. Oh no. So with the Queen's Crown, I get even more swing size. So it was good to not ignore the cleave before, but to not get it. I can get that food, but again, wait. So a run like this would be great for, um, well... Yeah, I thought so. So, uh, any kind of hex run, this type of run where you're getting just nothing but good stuff. Always fine. So, But the reason I'm kind of not... Because I know I'm playing this game for a long time, I don't want to rush into hex runs and... You know, if I try... It's like... Um, if I do all the challenges straight away, I'll leave myself nothing for the future. So I do want to get to everything, obviously, obviously at some point. But we're here forever, guys. Well, me as LST is here forever. Again, you can't play the same game forever. And we're going to be going into other games such as Rogue Legacy 2, Spelunky 2, good games like that. However, they will have their time in the sun. And Undermine, oh man, you know, I can't move away from Undermine just at the moment. Like, not in any serious way. It's always going to get played. In the current timeline. Current peasant timeline. So we need a key. We don't have a key. Oh, no. We're not missing out a relic. We can't do it. It cannot be done. Ooh, we need to bomb into that. We've got bomb size. We slot a bomb in there. It didn't slot. Key and fish and bomb. And even more bombs. And even more money. I do love the other mine. The resources are so nicely balanced. That you find yourself... Really, really exploiting the good item relics. And if you don't get any, you can still not run out of relic, uh, run out of items. Like, the game can be generous, but the game can also switch that round and be very harsh to you. I do like the swinging nature of the balance of this other mine runs. And it's why I like it for YouTube. It's just nice to get in for an hour, have a nice casual run. Admittedly, easier than the regular summoning stone runs we do. Ah, however, difficulty isn't everything, you know, I do like a challenge, but having a nice day, a nice little catch up we all, on the daily, it's the best, you know, it's the highlight of my day, as well as streaming, you know, they're both different, but they're both just, there are some things that I'm really proud of having built and done, um, if we start losing damage, this would be cool, but we're not gonna, and this is gonna be a useless relic, or... It's a bit of a waste of a key, because I don't plan on ever losing more than three armor. The, yeah, we probably... If that's the case, I could keep this major curse. Oh, that swing speed is looking cool. Right, we've got swing speed off the iron branch. Swing speed off the queen's crown. Swing speed off the paladin shield and swing speed blessing. Four different types of swing speed. Oh, I could go with money. But I'll probably want to wait for a glaze instead. And again, curse is stacking. I lose swing damage, but hopefully that'll be removed before they receive more damage. I'm not worried about it, but I, again, it's one of those that I want to push it if I can. I don't want to just, you know, do what I usually do. 
keep it clean on the curse all the time. You need to mix things up now and again. HP. Oh, we get the bomb resource. We get the throw distance. I'm going to save some money. I'm not going to need that HP. <laughs> he says confident in his, uh, you know, assessment. That confidence could quickly be ripped away. Again, the game can be a cruel mistress at times, but... That's why we like it. Aw. Again, I'm going to watch very closely. I get it, it's good science. No. What? Ah, oh, I kind of got distracted when I didn't eat it straight away. And I didn't see. If any of you could let me know in the comment section. If you saw that move, you know, get it down. Get the recording of the video down to 0 0.25 times speed. See if it increases, you know. Let me know. I can't tell. <laughs> I can't do it. My eyes don't move that fast. For that specific thing, you know? I'm playing roguelike games and my eyes need to move at a certain speed to be able to see all my peripherals. Oh shit, get it. Why can't he have bomb size? You know, he's useless. We'll slot one in that. Oh, I should have a pet rock somewhere. I've just realized how could I forget? Oh no, yeah, don't get on the oil. We're not sure if bats have been made easier. Like sometimes we think they've been made harder, sometimes we think they've been made easier. It's a ridiculous one. Key me. Key me, bruh. Get some throw damage as well. We don't get keys again. Oh, man. So we definitely... Ah, oh, there might be two shops. But I can definitely afford throw damage. We're building very well. Not, um, like, immensely well. We've had better runs, technically, but... As far as satisfying runs go, this is high up on it. Extreme nature of what he's doing here. Needs to be recognised. We just need bombs. And as soon as we get Pet Rock on the pedestal, as usual... <laughs> Bomb for a key, are you sure? We could sell. Th yeah, we f sell throw damage at low health. 400 money? Hell yeah. Always a pleasure. Stay safe. Yeah, business associates, me and you forever. Let's start our own mini business. You know, farming pilfers turns into a slime rancher. Yeah, we'll have a ball. You know, me and you. Maybe Crazy Eyes is. Uh, Extreme peasant Azalta's, you know, milady, his future waifu. Hmm, we've only got one key. Oi, 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 oi. The queen, for the queen's crown. Maybe, just maybe. And of course, we go in secret rooms. There is no pet rock here, so we just build on resources and money and a full heal. So, it doesn't matter if I've kept the receive more damage curse now. If I can get full health and then build back armor, we're fine. Yeah, you run, Pilfer. You run away. Um, I lose... Oh, no. I was about to say I lose armor for that, but I don't. It's a keyed. No, I can't. It's keyed. Unfortunately. That is the way it... So. Oh, one of them will be a four-key relic room. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Kurt stash other mine five right is this now turning into can I pop at the stash because we can't change it we might as well pick it up to oh I do love these where you get a Kurt stash at some point in the room and you're like can you pop it that is now your ultimate goal I'm going to take a bit of curse you know and I've already kind of suggested the reason why we have at some point in the future a good boy. The random heal, I'd rather save my money for food. Is there a potential for having me blowing my way in? Nah, there's a thing in the way. Ah, that route might, yeah, I think it's in the way. Either way, we run away as fast as we can in the opposite direction because despite this being an extreme peasant, he's shy. He doesn't, you know, he wants to, you know, waifu crazy eyes, but He's got the crown ready. It's kind of like the ring in uh, our world, you know, an engagement ring, but I want to bomb that, but now nah, we'll wait. We're so close to Pet Rock, I can smell him. <laughs> you smell Rock, you say? Yes. And has that distinctive cheeky smile. A distinctive cheeky smell. <laughs> right, refreshment time, halfway. Beautiful. 
Yeah, turning sugar free in my monster energy drink usage makes me feel a lot better, you know? And the fact that I've been able to do it. Because again, I've drank a hell of a lot of sugar in energy drinks for a, a decade and a bit, you know? It's one of those that making any sort of changes in your life can be really difficult. Because routine is, you know, rooted in our minds as safety in a way, you know? What you've done before and have experience in, your mind will consider safe. So if you move away from that, even something as silly as just, you know, sugar. It can be a tricky one, but I kind of trick my mind into thinking the energy drink I'm drinking is, you know, because it's sweet. Actually has sugar in it. <laughs> you know, brain hacks. Oh, no, I can't. Right, you come away. I need... To, they don't have a big explosion anyway, so... Ooh. I do not want them interfering with my rock. I have bomb size, you see, so... Come on, pet rock me. This is perfect. Don't you dare heal. My armor. This is a bit of an annoying one. Again, with this dude being a tank. Ah, that's a little bit of a secret room up there, but we'll wait again. Pet Rock should be incoming soon. He can actually show up kind of anyway. I didn't take that curse, did I? Ah. Oh. Right, we need to call ass on the old, uh, you know, curse him at curse face. Oh, there we go. No keys for it, though. Two key. Where are my keys, game? You're ruining me. You're literally operating on a basis that you want to ruin me, and I don't appreciate that. However... We can still blow these up. There's no pet rock, so we get onto business. Cash removal as well. Let me get some food. I mean, we've got resources for days. Key and armor. And this is why rock is very important, even if you don't have pet rock. Oh, curse removal? I Because I don't mind those two curses, I'm going to open the other curse. Even if it means, you know, because we're pet rocking. We are. Just in case this curse is debilitating, because I need to pet rock. I need to pet rock. I need to... Oh, major inflation, but we get another curse removal. I want the money. Oh, blessing for a bomb. Fantastic. Throw size for free? Hey. We remove the curse. We remove inflation. Pilfer? No! We can pick up money easier. We've got good money. I think I can go around buying bombs so I can do this. We're going to take the other curse after the other curse removal. Oh, no, we don't. We take it now. Tenderfoot? Oh, dear me. But we got a lot of bombs, meaning I can blow up some good rock formation. I can't jump anymore because I will lose my armor. <laughs> We're just about to go to a boss fight. However, come on, do it for me. Do it. Oh, yes, we can jump again. Oh, my God, that was... On the ragged edge, my friends. On the ragged edge. Um, throw damage? We don't have throw damage, and... Oof, we receive more damage, damage twice over. We got the major curse, we got the minor curse, but... It don't matter, we got four keys. We do not lose a relic room. I do like pushing the game like that. You know, and getting paid out. Having the correct things removed at the right time makes all the difference. So we're down to seven on the stash. War paint ain't any, anything to sing and dance about. We've got some good potions as well, so we got antimatter, which Tenderfoot would have ruined, obviously, and I would have received a one heal from it, unless I bombed myself. We have eight bombs still. My, my good Sir Knight and uh, my familiar is about to level up and start dropping me extra shield pieces. So, let's get into this little place for some bombage. Do we invest in food in shops? I don't really need the third one. The third one, mm, it's all right. But I'm saving money. Because we need keys still. Might need curse removal if we can buy it. Again, I don't need to stack the curse. There's no need to keep it. If I can. That's a secret, though. You can tell with the asymmetrical nature of the wall. You normally get three kind of rectangles that look very similar and one out of place rectangle. 
It doesn't guarantee it, but hey-ho. Oh, Pons. Girl, Ponzu face, and we receive more damage. We need to be careful. However, look at, uh, yeah, if I had Tenderfoot in here, that would have been a real possibility of dying. I would have lost my armor very early. With the receive more damage, I might have actually taken more than one damage from Tenderfoot, maybe. I'm not sure on that one. It wouldn't have been able to heal in this fight. Easy. I've always... The thing is, I would have always had this damage, though. So I would have been able to take advantage of staying still and doing the swing throw, you see? So... I don't think it would have been too risky. But still, you don't know things that don't happen. Nah, we got enough throw damage. Simple. Missed out forehead as well. Which I feel sorry for the game, you know, it couldn't even forehead me. <laughs> Couldn't even do it. And we take another major curse. Luckily, we get to choose from one. Oh, it's not even a curse. Actually, receive increased fall damage. I think we go with that. Decompression is a bit of a pain. We go with swing speed. Salamander setting things on fire or phantasmal. I think we go with phantasmal just in case we get the old... Uh... Salamander might be better. Um... But this is more pretty. Yeah, increase fall damage. We don't fall down anyway. I don't. I have no need to instantly remove that. Kind of like decompression, but I don't want to waste any money with pilfers. When fall damage ain't that bad. Level up. Oh, bombs. Give me my pet rock. As, as soon as we get pet rock, if we find any good rock formation anyway. Oh, I thought I was going to get burnt now. Yeah, check this. If you stay a distance away, he doesn't know what to do. <laughs> He'll try and approach you. He doesn't know what to do. He really doesn't. He's so confused. He's almost frightened at the confusion. You can do it with both of them. I do like that. Found that myself. I'm proud of that one. Didn't find everything I know myself. There's been great community effort in building a good strats to this game, you know. It's been great times. I appreciate everyone who's been involved. Either here on Twitch, you know, and in the um, Undermine Discord. It's been a great experience. Swing damage at high health. Absolutely. Nine extra damage. If only I had Salamander, <laughs> I, could, I could light those for a free chest. Right, let's curse remove if we can. Gonna be a tricky little room, this. Just need to have confidence in our swing throw. Yeah, before that, son of a bitch. But there's another one. Oh, we got six money from that bush. Who leaves money in bush? Who does that? I mean, ooh. One key for... Uh, nah. I'm alright. 1,000 money and we don't really have anything that special. <laughs> You're done, mate. You don't get a second chance. Not here. Oh, dear. There, we got the money. Shop it, and come on, pet rock. Pet rock with that specialist room. Gold double? Oh, why has it just got cheaper? Oh, is it like a random? I wonder how the sale in the shop works. Because having gold and popcorn go cheaper all of a sudden, and we've got great opportunities. We don't need the crit potion. We could use this straight away. I'd prefer to wait until we find minus flask, though. Look, that is a major investment with doubling. We get the throw damage. We can use that at any time. But I prefer to wait as long as possible until we need the money. Extreme. Told you. <laughs> it's all extreme. This could help me pop the stash. Although it might be... If it's minor curse, I don't mind taking a bunch of minor curse. Because they never really stack. Uh, the wall was just too plain, you know? Yeah, this is good money. It doubles now as well, so... Extra money for extra bombs. And pilfers. Oh, no! Oh, I got the money. Yeah, that extreme throwing pays off. I see a bomb pilfer up there. Run away. That's yeah, good, good, good. Right then. Curse time. We're going to have to take this minor curse for our own personal benefit. 
What are we seeing what we're doing? Interesting. We're not taking crew. There's not much uh, bomb size since we still haven't found pet rock. Is it going to be a pet rock basis kind of day? Yeah, swing speed and swing damage. I mean, 35 isn't amazing. But we can literally use pet rock to remove a hell of a lot of curse. And having bomb size be more effective in that. That's the direction we're going to go. We do have four keys. I could use one of the other chests. But I think we're alright. Again, that good healing. Literally three different types of healing potion. Just to protect me against any shenanigans. Two minor curse for Mjolnir. Oh, we're popping that stash and we take it. Nice. Yeah. We are Mjolnir now. Look at the eyes. They follow you around. I like this. I like peeking. Peeking through his wing. Just peeking. How you doing, guys? I'm not doing anything sneaky. But thank you. Ah, a creature that's dabbled in the forbidden. How does it taste? Mortal, do your lips crave another bite of that fruit? I'm sure you will find something to satiate yourself here. I'll leave you one little melting candle there. Not keep you in complete darkness. Uh, great times. Crazy eyes. What have you got for me? Bombs? 40 HP. More bombs. Of course we do. Always need them bombs. Three kiss. No, thank you. Mjolnir, however, if I swing throw... Because... Well, to swing throw in the first place, I have to be relatively aggressive and get quite close to the enemy. Don't you dare, Pilfers, don't you dare. You know what I'm talking about. I think Pet Rock is potentially above the exit, though. Biscuits, biscuits. Cash removal. Hey, we got our throw damage back. Biscuits, there's no point because I don't know when I'm picking up armor. Unless I get a bunch of it on the floor because my dude is at level 2. Oh, no pet rock yet. Please don't show up too late. It's not the biggest problem, regardless. Give me that food. Yeah, traps on the floor. Always watch the pilfer. Secret room up top. Oh dear, I did not see you. Again, it's just such a blank wall. It's kind of obvious. Oh, another shrine to pop of the stash shooter. Bomb size? Hell yeah. We're going to blow everything up. Including more secrets. Full heal, 10? Might not need it. However, having a little nap would be quite nice. Oh, Mjolnir come to the aid, aid at the end there with that little one fly. It's getting more extreme, my friends, more extreme. Pilfers can't handle this level of extreme. They have to fly away. Ooh. I can't really do that in other mine. Getting another familiar, that would be very dangerous because I wouldn't be able to heal. I... I can't potentially give away 500 health. Uh, I can always bomb it. We'll see if we can get any money together. I've got the money potion. You're laughing at me, sir? I mean, not anymore. Is you fucking dead? Extremely dead. Where's my 500 shell that will then double, you know? <laughs> Where is it, game? We're all expecting it. I could sell... Something to crazy eyes. Sell war paint. War paint is not doing anything <laughs> much. All right, my lady, how you doing? So, went the long way around. Uh, war paint. What are you gonna do with war paint? I'd love to see Black Rabbit, crazy eyes, in you know, sexy war paint. You know, what is this Braveheart all over again? 
Freedom. Freedom from Arcanos, I respect it. However, that is this extreme peasant's job. He will survive this, he will live another day. He's got the power. And he's got the technology. Yeah, Catalyst. Heal, one extra heal. When I heal. I'd rather go with this so I get more money. Minus flask. And extra resources. Bomb, key. Food. Back up to full health. No need for a tent. 10 out of 10 can relax and stay exactly where it is. It's good enough. Some other peasant may use that in the future. We're two away from Pop and the Stash. I think we've got another boss fight before we do it, so... Let's go. Hello. Don't you dare make a skelly. It's the worst. Where? Oh, hold on. There we go. Three secrets. Hey, my lady. Oh, get a key. Could even sell. Oh, pet rock. We take it now. What do we put on? Ooh. Well, no, we can get in there. We have to go round, and if there's any dude who breaks rock. No! Oh, you're being illegal. That is mine. What is that? He's tripping out, man. I want to pat them on the head. Can we not pat the pilfer? <laughs> Regardless. I think we're all good. I think we're all fine. I guess. Well, we'll take it. Just in case we ever need some good defense. That's 25% HP or lower. But yeah, having a bow as soon as I said, you know. Especially a throw bow. A regular bow, you can kind of control easier. Oh, you're all done for now. We want to find the secret rooms. Hopefully that big secret room with all that rocking. Oh, glorious pet rock with the glorious bomb size. Put Phantasmal down for a bit. We always put Pet Rock back on the pedestal, regardless. Hey, we've already been in that secret room. We don't need... Oh, we could. Yeah, we're going to have max HP. Max uh, money production. Unless there's an extra money blessing on this here thing. Our key. Secret room. Oh, come on. Be the secret we all want. It's not, but we get money. <laughs> Great money double production. None of those uh, mimics. There is a way of spotting the mimic. Little sparkly things are outlined red. Very subtly. You leave my money alone. Again, my dude is earning his holiday. His all expenses paid holiday. Currently got 1,173 to spend on vacation anywhere in the world where you can afford. We said money. Yeah, it's good times. I think there's a secret room at the top in there. A curse removal for an armor and get a bomb back. Very nice. Chug it. Hey, we don't take his... Oh, we got a HP back. Hmm. Not really needed. Come on, game. We don't end up getting the old rock room. But it's of no consequence, even though that would have, you know, allowed my peasants to go on a full way all the way around the world. Right, peasant trip. Tis a great tragedy. But I think we can make up for that. Keys? Hell yeah. Get swing damage as well. More key. I could always impish. <laughs> could always impish. However, I'm probably looking to just get as much money blessing as possible. Use this potion. And that'll be his, you know, retirement fund. Oh, rainbow. 
Oh, dearie me. Um. Well then. We get a rainbow in the mine. Not often you see that. Not at all. Got a swing damage. Something we don't currently have. We're popping the stashes with a rainbow. Oh, man. This is going to be awesome. If we can get some basic double as well. Oh, man. I'm excited. I told you it was going to be extreme. You don't have an X in your name without being totally extreme. My lady. I hope you didn't want that bush. <laughs> get my phantasmal back. Pet Rock, you've done a great service. Yeah. Could always double... Yeah, double the money, you know? When I finally pop the stash, double the money. We'll have a great time. Everyone involved will recognize what a good time we had. Where? Oh, it's the boss fight. Nice. Oh, we're popping the stash in the antechamber. Interesting. Is that a problem? Not really. Not at all. As long as we can put as long as we get two potions from the stash, we're fine. Well, as long as we survive this boss fight. <laughs> Let's get to work. Oh, yeah, Mjolnir doesn't actually electrify the water. It's good times. Yeah, absolute devastating power. What are you doing with your mate? You need to oof conduct yourself in a more rigorous way. I think we can go for it. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> Armor. Hold on. <laughs> Never gonna touch me. The perfect defensive strategy here, my friends. And trust me, it's going to pay off. <laughs> uh, you can get him even higher up in the air, but we don't have time. Unfortunately so. So, how much... Get in the comments now, from this point on, how much you think he's going to get. For his holiday fund, we'll have a quick beverage. Oh dear, we want curse removal. Uh, all, all enemies ignite the peasant. It's fair enough. We get many a potion. So, we pop down the money potion. The curse removal can stay and get doubled. Um, and rainbowed. Yeah, antimatter is probably better. If I can use an antimatter leaving here, that'd be cool. We double the throw speed as well. Anything else to double? Nah, we're fine. Could double a full heal, but there's no real need. Oh, that is awesome. We double these as well. <laughs> these blessings on the table. Wonderful. And we probably... Yeah, we just go with strength. Take the money. We take the reflection. It doesn't really matter, that one. We'll just do the old curse removal now. We pop at the stash. We remove all enemies ignite the peasant. We remove... My throw speed. And double crit as well. I didn't even see the crit. Yeah, we don't need impish. We got 22 kiss. And we just want still more money blessing now. Oh, we are power. Yeah, impish. See you later. I mean, if we get keyblade, the keys are already higher than the Bombs anyway. Fantastic times. In the final area. Final set of area. Pilfer, pil- oh, Pilfers don't get hurt by Mjolnir. Well, it makes sense, to be honest. All enemies shall fall, fall before this level of extreme behavior. Ah, 69 damage. Well, it's a sign, isn't it? Even more money. Oh, 
I think we can get up to five grand, and that'll be a halfway around the world trip. You know, you need ten grand for that, uh, ten thousand gold for that all the way around the world trip. Again, other mine is a reality show made by Arcanos for the middle class village. Takes people from the peasant village and, you know, kind of abuses them in a little way, but hey, it does get offered a nice holiday at the end of it all. Um, good curse removal here. There's nothing I really want. Throw damage! <laughs> yeah, we've lost two swings, uh, sw two swing damage with the curse. That's the only thing that's getting in the way of all this. Good behavior. Um, I'm not going to use free keys on that. Oh, that's good money, though. Yeah, we need to use our resources. We do. Swing speed as well, very nice. If we can get more money, it is worth it. There's a curse there, but I don't think it's what we need anymore. Ah, It is not a problem, though. We shall move on. This seems like quite a linear floor, to be honest. Oh, I dropped a bomb for no reason. Yeah. Bow. Ooh. I didn't take spiky boots either, so I need to watch it slightly. Only slightly. Two curse? No, thank you. Um, no, thank you. You can use two keys on those and you might get an item back. <laughs> and it should give you, it should have a, like a 5% chance of getting a relic on those. Well, a small chance. But still. Ooh, bo! Bo is a spicy boy. We've always known this. Hey, I'm a bag. My dude should be able to hopefully get to full experience. Whoa. Full experience and we can use our armor in the final fight to devastate everybody. Now we're getting there. Especially if we can get hurt on purpose when we find armor. Nope, I'm not removing all my armor just for that, thank you. So, still got two money, we still need money blessing though. And that rainbow with the stash. Very, very pleasant. It's the kind of thing you uh, really want to happen in the old other mine. Pop in the stash. Eh, I mean, if you get it early enough, it's never that much of a problem, since you're forced to take curse and you've got your shrines. Mmm, it's 200 for a potential money. Oh. <laughs> um. Hey, we don't receive fall damage anymore. Well, <laughs> we don't receive much fall damage anymore. Hey, Shadowfang, we've already got 23% crit, so we'll get more. Get up to 34. We spend a bit of money, it's fine. Yes, swing damage. We can't neglect the old damages. That'd be counterproductive. Spent half our money, but it was a good investment. Oh, the old guidance. The old ricochet with Mjolnir. My swing throw technology becomes weaker, but I've got a powerful enough throw now that we can just dominate. Injure everything in the room, then go up and swipe and finish them. If we find another rainbow or all potion and double these two money potions. Oh, simple chest. Still haven't got our uh, swing damage curse removed. It's a shame. It is what it is, though. I'm not complaining. It's just the way it is. Oh, my armor. No. Yeah. Well, at least if we have to pick up armor in a bit. We'll get experience for it. Oh, you can use your bombs. Oh, look at that throw speed with the Phantasm. If I can get bottled lightning, though. No. Yeah. I don't have protection against fire. I thought that ham was a skull then, <laughs> you know, the red skull. Nah. 
Ah, oh, saying that, it is HP. We do have a ham on the floor. Oh, bless him. Hey, explosion size, just what we need. More ham. More. And we essentially made $6 and explosion size. I do like the particle effects of the bombs a bit more. They're looking very cool. Interesting for a single bomb. We get some money. Get all the money though before the pilfers come. Your son's a bitches. Healing effectiveness, just in case. We need that healing. You know what? We need to use our keys, we need to use stuff. Da, 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 da. If I open a shop, I'm just gonna have that music on repeat always. Most definitely. Oh, you're, you're done for, lads. But we're still... Considering our power, the tank. Stop doubling the money. Oh, we do a bit of crit. This is going to be nice for the throw. Arrows will go everywhere. It's going to be a bit messy, especially with the meal near and everything. Because you're more likely to kill on a crit, you know, because you're doing more damage. The problem is, if they're shooting arrows, I'm shooting arrows. I don't know which ones to dodge. <laughs> Now you can take that five. Never found gold bombs, you know? My biggest disappointment. We could have been rich. More so than what we're going to be. Yeah, you can start a chain reaction with this arrow thing as well. Especially if you're on that old potion loop. Right then, let's go down to the last floor. The last extreme floor. For an extreme peasant. With lightning now. Ooh. We got we get a taste of the lightning lifestyle. And we do. What a beautiful, beautiful mess. If this, uh... Ah, oh, we get some more cursor. Ah, oh, demon ring. Increase swing damage. Four key relic room might as well. Oh, our... <laughs> ah. It's useless now. Oh, a lightning. We get permanent lightning. With our temporary lightning. With Mjolnir. Yeah, I love that throw builds, especially another might have been made more viable. Throw builds in other mine were always viable anyway. Just more viable is always a nice thing to hear. <laughs> you love it, mister? I don't want to be laughed at. I'm cool not being laughed at. Oh, level three by the last fight. Toxic? Toxic. I will take it. Poison and lightning. <laughs> With everything we've got. It's a beautiful day. A beautiful time to be alive. And Pilfer, see you later. Oh, credit card, we can't. Apple as well? Oh, come on. <laughs> we have to take it. Maintain our cripple, triple S tier credit rating. Otherwise, you know, the bank of Pilfer might come at me and say, why aren't you, you know, spending your money? I don't I don't think I can make that diagonal jump. I didn't pick up spiky boots. I got the reflection shot. We're fine. <clears throat> hey, extra money. Hello. Oof.
Oh, nice little fighting room. Before we finish up it. Told you it'd be extreme. Oi. Again, we need as much money as humanly possible. What are we getting? Shuriken? No, thank you. Oof. Right, second wave. Can't trade this. Ah, it's a single lurker. Come on, money. He needs his holiday. Oh, We lose a bit of HP, but that's no matter. That's no mind. Right, we'll do it in this corner so we can see. The potion duration with the money double with our thick axe throw. Pilfer! Oh, he's taking the big bit though. 2,000? Oof, 500? Can we get back? Can we have a halfway around the world trip with 5,000 money? I'm not sure. <sighs> not sure at all, but 4,000? Maybe he can get like a thousand gold loan. He's got his credit card, he can. <laughs> you know. See half the world, more than the peasant has ever seen before, so we can just pretend to him it is the entire world, you know what I mean? He'll enjoy that. Ooh, how much? Oh, if that's money now. <laughs> that's a money blessing. Oh, no. It's fine. Swing damage. But 4,274 at the moment. Going into the final boss fight. Ah. Blah! Ting, ting, ting. Not a bad supporting role. With the sound effect ting. We never fought Seer. Oh, no. Boom. Oh, we're on a cooldown. We've lost all our armor new. Actually, I am getting decked here with that damage. That was serious. Because we got received more damage. Um, in good times. And that ball, it kind of worked its way around here. But 4,274 gold. Peasant. Zaltir. You are a glorious peasant who has done great work here today. I'm sure you will enjoy your holiday. You survive. You know, you make peasant kind look good with your extreme nature. We appreciate you. And congratulations. But thank you for watching all the way through. I really do appreciate your support here on YouTube and on twitch.tv forward slash let's suffer together. Make sure you come check us out. We're playing in the mine pretty much most days, you know. Apart from, you know, we're checking out some new games in the future as well. Keep your ear to the ground for great roguelike games. However, if you like to, if you like the content, always consider leaving a like, subscribe, and that kind of thing that really helps support the channel. I really do appreciate it, and, you know, we're here forever. So this is always, a, hopefully, a great re resource for some chill, nice runs of roguelike games. But anyway, until next time, my friends, you take it easy, take care of yourself, and I'll catch up with you in the next episode. See you later, my friends. Take your credit card and run. Go on that holiday, my friend. You deserve it.